Welcome back. It is almost Fat Tuesday, and you know what that means. Time to get your punchki on. Uh, the difference between a punchki and a jelly-filled donut to me is the punchki tastes a whole lot better. Hi, I'm Scott Smith, baker at Party Cake Shop Bakery in Brookline, and we are making punchkis. The dough for the punchki is more, it's a yeast base, so it's more dense. We put them in a fryer where we deep fry them for four minutes, roll them in sugar, fill them with the filling. Then they go out in the store, and hopefully they run out the door. Punchkis, I believe, started in Poland, and they seem to have taken off here in the United States probably about 25 years ago. Last year, I made 602 dozen for Fat Tuesday alone, so this year I'm I might be looking at 700. We pronounce it punchki, but it, it sounds different than the way it looks when it's being spelled. Punchki, punchki, both work. Punchki is how, how we would say it in, in Poland. They don't really know exactly how to pronounce the C and Z together, but they are trying. This is so heartwarming. It shows you that Pittsburgh is so open to learning those things and to to give it giving it a shot to say it. Pączki. Nazywam się Agnieszka, jesteśmy w SND Polish Deli w Pittsburghu, w Strip District, a wy oglądacie Fan Nation. Hi, my name is Matt York. I work at Party Cake Shop in Brookline. I love my Pittsburgh sports team so much, put my skin in the game. I grew up watching the Steelers. They were winning Super Bowls. And I always wanted to do a Pittsburgh uh, theme on my arm. So Joe Capone, he put the incline in there, Pirates piece, the buildings, Penguins logo, Steelers logo. I have the uh, the point, Heinz Field. One of my favorite memories was uh, going to both Winter Classics with my wife and watching the Penguins play. Uh, the, next, the next artwork I'll get done is I'll finish my upper arm. I work with my hands every day. I'm always reminded of the great city and great sports teams, the city I live in.